coming up next. It's a UFC featherweight division fight. So we've got two classically trained strikers here. Any chance this fight actually goes to the ground? This fight does not go to the ground. This one will be fought in the pocket. Two guys will stand in front of each other. They will trade punches. They will trade kicks. It's going to be a classic matchup that you normally see inside of a ring. We get it in the octagon tonight. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that. So he catches the kick there and beautifully counters with the takedown. So a nice job turning that defense into some immediate offense there. He did a great job of turning his defense into his offense, but you can see that he's done that time and time again. He drilled that exact action and it worked in this instance. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the gentleman. Big call to punch lands. Now we get back to range. Oh. Under a minute. Oh, wow. wow. <laughs> Tries the flying knee to no Oh, straight right. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent pass out a little bit with all the ball. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. Beautiful body keeps laying right under the other. You better get that elbow down so then he slash the body right to your wrist. Final seconds of the fight. Big punch lands over the top. I was gonna follow this one. Oh, big knee to the body. How'd he get that one home? The official decision is now in. It resides with Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. Play the winner by unanimous decision. Three. Right, nice job by him there as he is your winner via unanimous decision and sometimes I would think it's easier said than